Hi friends, this is Aparna and welcome to Aparna's Magic. Today, I am going to show you how to make Achari Egg Masala. My style. So, let's get started. For that, we need boiled eggs or ubli hue ande. Here you take around 5 boiled eggs. This is tomato puree, 1 cup. This is onion or pyaas. Here you take 1 medium size onion. This is black salt or kala namak. This is nigella seeds, that means kalunji. This is called kalo jeera also. This is cumin seeds or jeera seeds. This is haldi powder or chamari powder. This is kashmiri red chili powder. This is jeera powder or cumin powder. This is lasun or garlic. This is mustard seeds or sarso and red dry chili. This is curd or yogurt or dahi. This is amchu powder that means dried mango powder. This is garam masala powder. This is ginger garlic paste, adrak or lasun ki paste. This is chopped coriander leaves that means chopped dhaniya patta. And this is ghee. Our oil is nicely heated up, so put 1 teaspoon of haldi powder or turmeric powder. Spread it nicely. Now add the eggs or uble hue ande. Let them fry for a while. Eggs are nicely fried, so we will take them out. Now in the same oil, put two red dry chili, one teaspoon of mustard seed or sarso, add jeera seeds or cumin seeds and kalonji, that means nigella seeds. This is called Kalo Jeera also. Let them crackle. Now add this is garlic or lasun into it. Let them crackle. Now add one tablespoon of this is ginger garlic paste into it. One cup of tomato puree into it. Mix it properly. Add one tablespoon of haldi powder or turmeric powder. One tablespoon of Kashmiri red chili powder. One tablespoon of cumin powder or this is jeera powder. One teaspoon of this is amchur powder or dried mango powder, and one teaspoon of black salt or kala namak into it. Now mix it properly. Let it cook for a while. Our gravy is simmering for 5 minutes now. So in this stage we will put 1 tablespoon of this is curd or dahi into it. Mix it. Add salt to taste and sugar to balance it. Add onion or pyaas into it. Mix it. And 
let them cook for a while. Our gravy is simmering for 5 to 7 minutes now, so it is almost done. So at this stage, we will put 1 teaspoon of, this is garam masala powder. Add some chopped dhaniya patta or chopped coriander leaves. Add 1 teaspoon of ghee in it. Now mix it gently. Look at the beautiful color and the gravy. And you are done. Stay tuned for more recipes and please subscribe my channel.